Hi, this is Roger Squatero, and I'm here to talk to you a little bit about being a professional musician, professional percussionist. There are several different aspects to this being professional. First and foremost, let's start with your skill set. Everybody that is going to be competing on a worldwide scale with other musicians needs to have your skill set be at a level that is competitive. Put in the time. All the great players have spent hours and hours and hours practicing and still practice. I've been playing over 40 years and I practice all the time still because there's no depth that's too great for musicianship. You spend your whole life playing, you'll never reach the bottom of what music can offer. So get that out of the way, practice. Be a professional on a skill level. Second of all comes to do with maybe things that are not so concrete but are equally as important. What is your attitude? When you're called to a job, remember you are working for the person that calls you. It's not about you, it's about what you can bring to the music. So, be sure that you don't piss off the person that's hiring you. Don't be a problem to them. Be accommodating. Give them what they want, what they're asking for. Another really important thing to being a professional is to stay in the now. Keep the big picture in mind. The picture is the music. And what is the music for? It's usually for an audience. It's not to bring attention to yourself. It's not to show off what you can do. It's to add a certain aspect to the music that makes the music better. And a big part of that is space. Don't fill up all the space with all showing what you can do or a myriad of sounds. Really be in the now and listen to what's going on. Sometimes just a little triangle hit or a tambourine hit or a light shaker is all that the music needs. And anything more takes away from the whole instead of adding to the whole. Be a positive force, both personally and professionally. When you go on a gig, bring positive energy. Know when to shut up. Know when to let, allow other people to talk. And this goes back to the ego thing again about it's not about you. Be a team player. Bring something positive to the music. Listen, stay in the now, take your inspiration from the greats that have come before you, do your homework, listen to the great players of your instrument that, that have already paved the way and opened the way to what you're doing. But don't get boxed in by tradition. Study traditions, know what traditional playing is, but allow your own creativity to take that from the library of your personal experience and knowledge and bring it forth to the situation that is called for. Don't just rely on what you've learned. Allow your mind to be open enough to be creative. And again, if somebody's asking you to play something that is not what you have learned traditionally, don't be an, a, a, a negative force in fighting them. Remember, when you're being hired to be a professional, you're being hired by somebody else. Bring to them what they're asking for, and you'll get hired a lot more. So there we go. Skill set, get your reading and your chops up, stay in the now, be positive, and uh, keep creating.